Okay, let us resume everybody. We're on the way to Gondolia. The path to Andolia. La 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 la. Then we're gonna have some bridges to cross. Oh, we're in like a marshland. Look at this. Marshlands and rain. We're we'll talking about a climate change. What is that? A hand came out of the ground. Whoa! Okay then. Looks like the enemies have ramped up here. Maybe I can put the splatty punk to sleep. Nope. Oh good, money hand calls for backup and another money hand shows up. Ow. Money hand calls for backup. Another muddy hand shows up. Oh good, a sultry dance. Didn't work. Ow. Silvando has pepped up. He killed the splatty punk. See if she knocked them. She killed them all. Damn. She killed all the hands. Oh, he became electrocuted. Paralyzed, it can't move. Nice. Very nice. I got a medicinal herb. I saw something floating out there. I don't know what that is. An enemy. Enemy. Uh oh, calling for backup. <laughs> Headbutt. Ha, lick to the fly thon. They love to call for backup. Oh, nobody shows up. Ha ha. He had no friends. They never show up. two of the money hands. Okay. Hands, hands made of duty. The duty hands. The Did duty hands come right? out of the marsh. Whoa. A fine fur and a medicinal herb. Two item reward. Look, there's stuff out there, right? You see there's some kind of an enemy, glowing enemy out there. Oh, there's also a chest I see. Apparently there's some, some good stuff in this swamp. Okay. Kill. Victory! A snake skin. There we go. 
So we can't go in the water, no. Which sucks, if you look out there, there's items. See that? There's items out there. I don't know how to get to those platforms, though. I think maybe later you get an ability to jump or something. Whoa. There's a glowing enemy. I gotta see what the hell it is. It's a rare enemy or something. Look at this. Five money hams. Oh my god, there's even more money hands. <laughs> ah, no one showed up. There's sentient hands made of mud. It's so weird. Killed them all but one. Sentient hands. Eric leveled up. Damn, he needs one more skill point. He still didn't get enough to dual wield. He's close, though. No, he needs more. Damn, one more level, and finally I can do a wheel with Eric. Now we're alright. So why is this one glowing? A midnight quirk light. I don't know what the significance of a glowing enemy is. I guess we're about to find out. Oh, now I'm poisoned. Great. I don't know. We can now ride it. Oh, shit. Oh, look. Now I can fly around. I need the antidote. So this is how I get all the items in this area, huh? A seed of skill. An urn of real soil. So that's kind of cool. I look for glowing guys and a lot, you know, even in the world. I thought it was only for like dungeons and stuff, but no, even in the world. You can ride these things around. That's pretty cool. <clears throat> A celestial skine. Whatever the hell that is. Can't go this way. Okay. Well, that was neat. I like that. Now we can continue on. Alright, I gotta dismount. Some mining. Okay. Alright. Moving on. So we're in a bog now. Oh, the rain's back. Oh, it's the cow. The cow will know the weather. The sky should start to clear here at night. Perfect weather for adventuring. So this is come back at night. I wonder if at night things change, like different enemies and stuff. The Laguna de Gondol Gondolia. Yeah, we gotta get to it. It's in the middle there, see it? What the hell is that? A tiger. A weird tiger. What the fuck? It's got a human face in its mouth. What the hell is that? Dude, that is disturbing. 
A tiger with a human's face in its mouth. What is going on? got a cat hat a cat hat what the hell is that he can't equip it neither can he neither can he neither can she well, who the hell equips the cat hat oh she does heart and soul wearing headwear that protects against cold and dark attacks part of the kitty kit so there are, if, for those who don't know, there are actual kits in uh, Dragon Quest of armor, and if you equip the whole kit, you get buffs and stuff. So it's part of the kitty kit. I'll hold on to it. It would give me more defense and more charm, but less magical might and magical mending. Now you know what? It actually is good enough. Yeah. The kitty kit. Put him to sleep. Good. <laughs> Nobody shows up. That's pretty funny. Ah, Black Sheep says if you go to items, equipment bags, scroll left, it'll show you most recent items. That's cool. Uh, Drew Bagamas says apparently Dr. Disrespect had his house shot at while he was streaming. That's awful. That's fucking absolutely awful. It's a hum horrendous crime. And the person should be found, prosecuted, arrested, and fucking have their life ruined for doing that. That's absolutely terrible. They could have actually legitimately hurt someone. Obviously, if you're shooting at someone, you're intending to hurt them. That's fucked up. Completely fucked up. Horrible. Yeah. There we go. People are just sick. What can you say? People are fucking sickos, man. What the fuck is the point of that? What what are you accomplished by doing that shit? A lot of enemies. A lot of enemies. Veronica now has 10 skill points. She learned Deceller Rattle. Minor MP recovery after battle. Anti magic. High chance of stopping enemy casting spells. Or Spooky Aura. We use an enemy resistance to all offensive spells. Or increases maximum MP. Fire and Earth resistance plus 20%. All these are good. Damn, they're all good. <clears throat> Let's learn anti-magic. Okay. Oh shit, whoa, 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 get off me. The fuck off me.
Here we go. If I get his his bug, then I can fly around and find optional stuff in this area. <clears throat> wow, he's having fun. <laughs> he's having fun. Yeah, we'll see how much fun you have in a second here, bro. I can write it. Can I write it out here? Yup, and here's some stuff. Good shit. Five perfectionist pearls. That's cool. Very good. Anything else here? Aha! A clump of fairy fluff. That's an item I haven't found yet. Any other items around the end? Let's just keep looking around the outskirts here. For, oh! Anything here? No. Nope. R2 is jump. The jump sucks. The jump's really low. A really low jump. Okay, I'm not seeing anything there. Let's keep looking around. There's the cow. Nothing hidden back here? No, not that I see. No. What's this patch over here? Nothing? Uh, it looks like it would be a good place for an item, but nope. There's some more of them. Nothing here? No. So this is the entrance to the town. Here's two of those tiger dudes. Anything hidden out here? Whoa, it clears up as you approach it. What the heck? The rain clears up. The rain totally cleared up. No, now it started again. <laughs> I guess as you go back to the bog, it restarts. If I go this way, this will take me over to another area. Yeah, a whole different area. Well, I probably don't want to mess with that. And fight these guys. Drew Bog asks, what's better, Persona 5 or Dragon Quest 11? They're, they're very different. Like, they are still turn-based RPGs, but as you can see, the gameplay style is different. Um... I don't know, that's gonna be a tough, a tough question to answer. I gotta keep playing. I gotta keep playing before I can answer that. Shocked! He doesn't have enough MP. What an idiot. He's trying to cast a spell he can't cast because he has no MP. He's paralyzed. Still paralyzed. Score one for the good guys. <laughs> Alright. It's four skill points. That's not going to be enough for anything. The 30 frames per second is making Ke Kevi Akage nauseous. It's not that they put a lot of motion blur in the game. Why? I don't know. I honestly don't know why they put as much motion blur as they did into the game. Oh. And yeah, he does look like Psyduck, doesn't he? He's Psyduck before Psyduck existed. Keep in mind, Dragon Quest came out in the 1980s before Pokemon ever existed. So Pokemon technically copied off of this game. <clears throat> Everyone's pepping up. Whoa! So we got, look at this. Tempered Chantrum sets about a single enemy with a blazing hot blade. We already need a real decoy. Care Prayer increases all allies' defense and magical quite a bit. Wild Side enables Eric to make two moves per turn. Gives his attributes one heck of a boost to boot. Those are all great. Don't need them now, though. <laughs> all right. We did it, darlings. 
Genetic Gamer is asking, what's the be best way to contribute? Is it Teespring or is it, um... Is it Teespring or is it, like, a patron pledge? The answer there is a patron pledge, for sure. I made more off the patron pledge than I would off of you buying a few things from Teespring. But if you prefer to get a collectible, a t-shirt or whatever, I'd rather you get what you like. All right, let's see how this looks. The wild side. Take a walk on the wild side. Damn! He goes beast mode. What the shit? He went beast mode. Yeah, Genetic Gamer, the best way to help me right now would be to tip me. Tipping me right now is would help me more, and I, there's no, I, like, I don't lose anything from a tip, versus no matter if you do Patreon, if you buy a t-shirt, they all take a cut. All that would happen, there's a processing fee when you send me a tip, but the tip, I get the most out of it. So if you're being genuine about your, your question, the best answer I give you is tip me. Tipping is the best way to contribute. Yeah, there's no way I can sell autographed Teespring merch because I don't have the merch. Teespring makes it and ships it straight to you. It's not like I have the t-shirt sitting around here or anything. Nice, he killed the armor. QB, yeah, that was the move I had to do the Spitfire. That pet move, that's for the side mission, I know, but we're nowhere near Spitfires anymore, so... Maybe later in the game I'll come back and care about doing every side mission. <laughs> Killed it. That'll be a good one for boss fights, because basically it makes Eric, like, super, Easy. super tough. And also dealing so much damage, right? A word for joining friends with your friends before 10 pep powers. Nice. Can I kill this guy? I see there's, like, something over there that I can do. Dead and dead. He's having fun. He just stands there like an idiot, having fun. <laughs> Got him. Another one, fight. I don't even want to ride the hornet. Fuck it. All right, so what's over here? Uh, chest. Pass these guys. A lot of muddy hands. <laughs> Slaps you right in the nuts. They jimmy tap your 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 testicles. It hurts so bad because they're jimmy tapping your testicles. Be gone. But no one shows up. No one shows up. Slap to the nuts. The enemies in this uh, swamp drop a lot of items, I've noticed.
Okay, here's that chest. Oh shit, dude, like a hundred more hands popped up. A recipe book. I love iron armor. So I learned how to make iron helmets, iron cuirasses, and a suit of iron armor. Wow, that was awesome. Damn, I saw mining. There's a mining material over there. So if I go back and get that bee, I could fly over there and get it. Is the bee still here? It is. I want to go back and get that, uh... Oh, fuck. I ran into the guy. I want to go back and get, get that mining materials out there. Boom, boom, boom. Genetic Gamer says, One thing I don't like about JRPGs is sometimes they charge full price, but they don't have English voice acting. Not only does this game have English voice acting... Apparently, the Japanese version didn't have Japanese voice acting. There was none. So only if you bought this version of the game did you even get voice acting. It was pretty crazy. Think about that. People in Japan bought this game and it was completely silent. That's kind of messed up. Killed them all. Thank goodness. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, goody gosh. Oh, wait. That's the mining I already did. Oh, shit. I thought it was hidden mining out in the lake. No, it's the one I already did. All right, forget it. Let's go to the town. <laughs> Let's go to the town. Oh, God, these guys respawned. I'll fight these tiger guys again, I guess. These tiger guys are pretty easy, and they might drop an armor set. Put him to sleep. Good. <laughs> Freddy Balls asked, what would I name my video game company? I don't know. I have no idea. I've never really thought about making a video game company, so... She slapped him away. Eric, he's healing. Okay. Alright, kill this guy that goes to the town. But I'm hoping that he'll drop rare armor. I wonder if we keep fighting these, he'll drop the whole cat set of armor. Night, night. Great. Oh, it didn't work. Never mind. I'm on fire! Ah-cha-cha-cha-cha! He's on fire. She kills him with her wand. Kitty litter? He dropped kitty litter. Ew. Hopefully it's not used kitty litter. Alright. I made it. Here we are, Gondolia. Welcome to Gondolia. Boom, 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 boom. Gondolia, what a nice town. A oh, big roided sailor. Oh, oh yes, look at me. 
Pretty ballsly chat cheered. He says, I don't care what stream chat thinks. I love it when he plays JRPGs. Suck it. Yeah, you got two or three whiners in stream chat. What do you need to do? You always have it. Oh, it never, it never fails. They're still here, even though they know I'm playing a JRPG. They just still complain. Beautiful place. <laughs> it feels as though the whole town is bobbing up and down on the waves. So this is Gondolia, huh? I heard there were some big scores to be had here. Rich merchants from all over the world, ships full of treasure, you name it. And this is where you're keeping your ship, Silvando. The ship that you own. Don't tell me you're some kind of millionaire. <laughs> oh, come now, Ronnie, darling. You know it's not polite to pry. All right. The docks are in the southwest of the town. Last one there's a rotten egg. What the hell? It's Goten. Uh, Goten. Goten is spying on him. Gondolia. Benvenuti a Gondolia. So it's supposed to be it Italian. Yeah, it is. You want to visit the docks at the west part of the city? Maybe better to check a map. Excuse me. Ooh. Seller of weapons. A rapier, a broader sword. It's double-handed. Yeah, the rapier is all right, but my sword that I got plus three is better. However, let's see here. The posy pole and wizard staff are good. Buy a second poison moth knife. Reason being, soon we're gonna have um, dual wield, and I want him to be able to have both both weapons. So I'm gonna buy it. Yeah, I'm gonna see what I got for these weapons. Actually, the rapier would be good for him. Yeah. Okay. Oh, a word of a spending 2,000 gold coins at once. Big spender. It's the armor shop? Yes, it is. A gold platter? It's a shield about the equal as mine. Ah, Silvando can hold a gold platter. Iron shield. Actually, a better shield. Iron shield. Oh, wow. Everything's good. Oh, there's the cat hat. You can actually buy it here. <laughs> Bunny ears. That's silly. That's pretty silly. Iron armor. I'm not gonna make iron armor because I could craft iron armor, right? And iron the iron hat, and I, like I learned the iron set, so I'm not gonna be doing that. Iron helmet, iron armor. Yeah, there's no reason to do that. I can just I can just get it later, but I will get a gold platter for him to for Silvano or Silvando. Excuse me. There we go. The turban is like a negligible effect. It's not that big of a deal. The bunny ears are pretty good increase. Alright. I guess that's all I'm gonna do for now. Yeah, because the Iron Curious is better, but... The Iron Curious is better, but can I make it? I don't remember if they said I can make Iron Curious or not. I know they said Iron Helmet and Iron Armor, but I don't know if they said Iron Curious. Hmm. Alright, I'm not gonna do anything else. I'm gonna see if I can sell anything. Yeah, I can sell the Divine Dagger plus three now. A shitty thorn whip, so that. Oops. I'm the divine dagger. So the old calf. Yeah, sell the fairy staff. Ow. 
in my eye. Anything I can sell? Ah! I'm sure these are all crafting items, so I really don't want to sell them, right? Yeah, I'll sell these fucking bro iron broadswords. Oh, no, I can sell the silver platter for sure. Sell the cruiser ring, that sucks. Sell the feathered caps, both of them. Sell the bronze sword, don't need that anymore. Okay. I wanna sell I wanna sell the boxer shorts because they have sweat and regret. <laughs> sweat and regret. It's too good. Alright. It's saying that there's an inn. Anything back here? Can I grab these pots? No. Everything's locked, huh? Yeah. No! I busted into this person's house. I busted right in. You hear about the tentacular who caused so much havoc around the harbor? No. Terrible. My husband told me all the time about him. It's a giant monster who attacks our ships. Oh, great. A giant, a giant and evil monster coming up. Probably gonna be a squid or the, the kraken. Viva Senor Universo! Whatever the fuck that means. The contest, it says. I like she doesn't question why the hell I'm in her house. Like, what the hell are you doing here? Okay. This old guy. Placido is a very good boy, kind and polite. Doge Rotondo, he must be very proud. He followed his father and become a successful merchant one day, I am sure. A pitch pearl. I don't know what that is. Doge Rotondo, the best in the business. I'm not gonna read that. Okay. <laughs> I'm not reading that. I guess I can keep going, keep investigating. Looks like there's, yeah, I was gonna say there's a lower area too. But I kind of skipped it by going up here. And yeah, that's how you get down, right there. I'm assuming that th that's where you need to go. I don't know. No, he said west. Didn't he? he said to the west. So this probably isn't it. Some kind of a sailing competition or something here. Look. Whoa. Look at the hat on this guy. He's a harp player. Fa la la. Cha. Let's go. Okay. I lost my job. You know who's to blame? The Darkspawn. This guy's drunk as shit and he blames the Darkspawn for losing his job. Oh, look! Akare Riviere? What in the fuck is that? What the hell is Akare Riviere? A pendant that prevents spells and abilities from being sealed away. Ah! So it won't give you any defense boost, but it prevents people from stopping you from doing, uh, using your abilities. I'll give it to him. There you go. That's a good item, huh? That's a pretty good item. Silenzio, por favor. If you make the noise, my sister will find me. Ha ha ha! Please thee, am I fearing the eyes may have those except me a heartfelt oh no <laughs> Oh my god this game is something else <clears throat> Stupid Freaking stupid 
A sprig of wave weed? What is wave weed? Here's one of the gondolas. Oh my god. Anyway, <laughs> keep going. Anything here now? Nothing like hidden or anything, right? Okay. I'm back. <clears throat> There's a guy fishing. This guy. Ooh, my head. Nothing in here, huh? Uh, oh, okay, what's this? The Diary of Tetsu the Smith. I guess he's a blacksmith? The dream is Chase. I am Tetsu. I'm 48 years old. I'm a blacksmith. In Gondolia, a clue to the metal source from a strapping man. Far beyond the sea, a school for metal hunters lies in the valley. He's talking about mini metals. He's telling us how to spend our mini metals. He says that this place teaches the metal secrets. I must learn them too. I'll return to school. Funny how perhaps at my age, this is my dream. Do not fear, mother. I'll become a great smith. Interesting. So we're going to find the middle place far away from here, apparently. You know, it's we're at a restaurant. Ah. A restaurant. Twenty-four gold coins for smashing that. That goes downstairs. What else is up here? Ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba -da. Is this where I'm supposed to go? Yes, yeah, this is the the port area. I'm gonna keep looking around. Oh, there's a church. It's on the ground level, I guess. Can't get to it from here. What are they doing? What the hell? He's yelling at this guy to pick up a box. Can full of glass frit. What the fuck is glass frit? The bar. Give me a drink. I command it. There's the church to save the game. No, no book. No, this isn't the church. It's an item shop. A utility bill. It boosts your deftness. It's expensive. Alright, I don't want that. Here's the locked door. Every time there's a locked door you can't open. Later on, I'm sure I'll have to go back to all these. Where the hell was the church? It showed a church up here. Right? I swear it showed a church. Further down, down here. Pindo Beast Cheer to ask me how am I enjoying the game so far. I'm liking it a lot. I love it. I love it. Look, we're exploring this giant big town. Yeah, another really cool town. Aha. Uh -huh. Anything here? Recipe book. Filigree for fun and profit. I learned how to make gold platters, chains, and bracers. So even though I bought the platter, now I can make my own. And chains and bracers, however, I'm going to have to find gold ore to make those out of, I'm sure. That's a good one, though. That's a good blueprint. Save up. Save up. Hindo Beast Cheer said, Divinity, Divinity Original Sin is also a cool game. It would be cool to see me play it with long as fuck. Ooh, yeah, that's what I heard. A lot of people love Divinity, Divinity Original Sin 2 last year on PC. It was a PC exclusive. Um, but I've heard that a lot of people love the game. Some people it was like the game of the year pick, so... 